ஹலோ கைஸ் வெல்கம் பேக் தேர் இஸ் அ வெரி வெரி இம்பார்ட்டன்ட் அனௌன்ஸ்மெண்ட் ஃப்ரம் ஐசிஎம்ஏஐ தட் இஸ் த இன்ஸ்டியூட் ஆஃப் காஸ்ட் அக்கௌண்டன்ஸ் ஆஃப் இந்தியா இட் இஸ் அ கோயிங் டு பி அ குட் இனிஷியேட்டிவ் அண்ட் இட் இஸ் அ ரிமார்க்கபிள் சேஞ்ச் இந்த த என்டயர் சிஎம்ஏ இன்டர் அண்ட் ஃபைனல் எக்ஸாமினேஷன் எஸ்பெஷலி வாட் இஸ் தட் பர்டிகுலர் டூ இட் இஸ் நத்திங் பட் ஃபார் எம்சிக்யூஸ் ஐ ஹவ் ஸ்போக்கன் திஸ் வித் த மோஸ்ட் டாப் அஃபிஷியல்ஸ் இன் த என்டயர் சிஎம்ஏ ஆல்சோ அண்ட் மோஸ்ட் ஆஃப் த வெரி பர்டிகுலர் ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ் ஆல்சோ வி ஹவ் டிஸ்கஸ்ட் அபவுட் திஸ் திஸ் இஸ் அ சேஞ்ச் விச் இஸ் ஆல்ரெடி தேர் இன் சிஏ தே ஹவ் பிரிங் அவுட் தோஸ் திங்ஸ் இன் சிஎம்ஏ ஆஸ் வெல் தட் இஸ் அ வெரி சிம்பிள் திங் ஃப்ரம் நவ் ஆன் வேர்ட்ஸ் த எம்சிக்யூ இஸ் கோயிங் டு பி ஜஸ்ட் அண்ட் ஓஎம்ஆர் பேஸ்ட் இட் இஸ் அ பபிள் யூ ஜஸ்ட் நீட் டு ஷேட் இட் தெர் இஸ் நோ டைம் டு ரைட் அண்ட் ஆன்சர் there is no you should not never write one a this is answer like the rupees 10 lakh how the 10 lakh should be derived in the financial accounting paper never workings will be there you will just simply shade it that's a remarkable change in the entire cma examination which is going to save lots and lots of time this mcq is going to be a game changer and be focused on this mcq and just in quick important announcement is uh, before getting into a full fledged thing our double under series for group 1 and group 2 is day on daily basis we are uploading just go and check out our playlist as well then what is the important thing from now onwards in the cover page you are having two things one is part a one is part a next one is part b in part a you will write your roll number your sub code your medium and your date of examination and your roll number sticker in part b is going to be a remarkable change mcq type first 15 questions of 30 marks answer must be bubbled in a blue ballpoint pen or black ballpoint pen either one you should use if you are going to use black pen for writing shade it in a black pen if you are going to use blue pen for writing blue shade it in a blue pen for intermediate and final examination darken of bubble more than one for an answer will lead to the cancellation of the answer and zero mark will be awarded if the shade is if the answer is correct if you shaded properly you will get a mark if you are wrongly shaded and if you are chosen a wrong answer you will get a zero mark candidate need not to write the write the answer of the first 15 mcq inside the answer script pages except the cover page bubbling okay so you should not write this 15 questions answer you will just simply bubble it candidate must sign the signature of the candidate box in the cover of the page of the answer script only then you can write it in your own language whatever english or hindi okay next the candidate avail himself or herself an exemption based on the previous examination or the or based on the qualification but if she appears in the examination it shall be subject to liable for automatically withdrawn suppose if you have already having an exemption but you are forgottenly if you are going to appear on that paper that previous exemption will be automatically withdrawn then admit cards needs to be handed over to the invigilator most important point and you should please check the invigilator as sign the appropriate boxes you should get a invigilator sign in your admit card next this is a pro forma or a sample answer script of the replica of the original answer script in that first thing answer sheet serial key will already they will give you okay in this box in this box you will you will stick your roll number this is a date of examination roll number what how you should write the roll number suppose your roll number should be 210384 what you should write 210834 in the same words you should write you should not write in such a way that 21384 you should not write like this okay 201384 so you should write two, two, one. that's how you need to write and your subject name you should write group 1 first group or second group you should write english language english sub code 05 or 06 or 07 for inter and for final it will start from 13 14 15 16 16 and all and your roll number you should write then this is a bubble sheet you should only use blue ballpoint pen or black ballpoint pen don't use gel pen don't use high tech pens simply use ballpoint pen sing use only one pen many of them are told you can use black pen and blue pen as well simply use only one pen that is black pen you should use or you will use blue pen in a professional examination i would recommend you to go with the black pen then coming to the exam rules and regulation this is a very quick thing that the in the second point they said each day 15 minutes 15 minutes before the time fixed the examination hall will be open 
and allowable reading time will be first session will be 9:45 am to 10 am you can read the question paper okay and from 1:45 pm to 2 pm you will write your in the afternoon session you will write the question paper okay next next important thing i want to discuss with you is no person should leave the examination hall before the expiry of 2 hours okay you should leave the examination hall after the expiry of 2 hours and if you are going to leave such candidate need to submit his or answer script along with the question paper to the invigilator you should also hand over the question paper to the invigilator if you are going to leave the examination hall before before the after the expiry of 2 hours but before the expiry of the 3 hours okay next the candidates are not required to appear in the paper or papers in which they have granted the paper wise exemption and most come to the 15th point that is important part b portion of the cover page that is mcq first 15 answer must be bubbled in a blue or a black ball point pen appropriately for intermediate and final examination and all long answer type that is your 70 mark of descriptive okay that questions shall be written in the answer books page number 3 onwards they have recommended that they will never give you an additional sheet if you are leaving a page and write because some of the institute or some persons are telling that i will only write it on the right hand side they will never write it on the left hand side they will write a record notebook few students are writing and many students are leaving a line and writing in those cases i am just included a leaving a line point but they are saying if you are leaving a page if you are left blank in between the answers okay in between the answers given by the student in the, is the liable for cancellation means this is a very important point you should see suppose and along with the type of answers question shall be written on the answer book page number 3 onwards and supplied at the examination hall all the long type answers must be written on the both sides of the paper and no page should be left blank in between the answers given by the student else is sir paper is liable for cancellation next what they said additional sheets will be provided to the candidates only and only when the candidate writes out on the both sides of the pages of the answer book first supplied to him or her such additional sheet should be signed within the day with the data by the invigilator and the number of additional sheets used to be mentioned on the cover page of the answer book in the specified box duly signed by the invigilator when additional sheets are used those must securely fastened with maintain the answer book by the candidate very simple thing the barcode will be available in the attendance sheet while signing the attendance sheet you should take the barcode and you should paste it on your answer booklet okay that is a very key point this pdf is easily available in a website you will just check it out and you should download it okay have a great day guys do well in your examination the videos of double under series is going to come on the way go and check out our playlist and the financial accounting exam oriented series we have already uploaded go and check it out okay this december 2024 examination is going to be yours give your give your full effort put more hard works the next 8 to 9 days is going to be a game changer for you so the next till the date of examination completion till december 17 each and every one should put your hard works and along with their smart preparation will achieve your success wishing you all humongous success in your entire professional life with the signing off of sudarshan have a great day guys